that's two in a row in this game for you. Talk about how exciting you are for this one here today. Uh, so, you know, so proud of our kids. Uh, you know, like I told them after the game, they work so hard uh, day in and day out. They, uh, like I said, tried to give them a day off a few weeks ago and they refused. They said, no, we're coming to practice. Doesn't matter if we're banged up. We needed, so felt like we needed some rest and they wouldn't allow it. They just said, nope, we're coming to practice. They, they work hard day in and day out. They are such a tough group. They, they will do anything to win. They will fight you tooth and nail to win. And if you want to take it into the pocket line, turn it into a street fight, they don't care. They'll fight you out there. In today's day and age, in 2018, the way you know kids are kind of coddled, it's just a breath of fresh air to come to work every day with these kids. They're, they just will not let us lose. They just they, they have done it all year long. After the first week of the season, they policed themselves and said, "We're not. this is not happening again. So I'm just so proud of them. I'm so happy for them because we work them really hard and, and we expect a lot out of them. So to get this kind of performance out of them today was awesome. Like that earlier this year, the blue ball, the blue ball again today. Any similarities between the two games? Or? They, you know, they, they're good. I mean, there's no, they're here for a reason. I think they got athletes all over the field. They got size. Um, you know, but we're really good too. You know, we got a veteran group, and at the end of the game, we just put it on our line. Uh, we got five seniors up front. Um, you know, JD made some great runs, made some great plays, and when we needed the three, four big yards, we were able to get them. And um, you know, I think when, once we got the momentum after the pick six, it was our guys could smell it. You know, they just they just got after it there on the last drive. And, and uh, anytime we need a big play, we just put on our line and they delivered. Yeah, it did seem early, like early on that, that your lines on both sides were dominating and, and, and taking them where they didn't want to go. I mean, it really it did seem like that, yeah, and I that mean, gave you guys room to operate. We, we pride ourselves on that attitude, that, that mentality that, that we're going to win the game up front. Um, JD. And, JD. you know, it was just we put it on those guys. We put it on them all week. Uh, you know, we tell them that when we need the big yards, we're going to ride them, and, and we expect that they're going to be able to deliver. And uh, Lester gave us some trouble early. We had to make an adjustment. Uh, Al Richards, our offensive line coach, and I uh, made an adjustment early early on in the second quarter. We were able to open up some holes for us up front. Um, like I said to the kids, total team effort. Every coach, every player, even the JV guys that do the scout team during the week, everybody had a hand in this. And uh, it's a credit to our kids and our coaches and our program. This is, this is what we work for since January, so it feels good. Congratulations.